First, as many of us know, it is so frustrating to come back to your car from downtown only to find the meter has expired and you've got a ticket. And it's even more frustrating when you learn the person who gave you that ticket violated the law themselves. A viewer posting this video on Facebook showing a parking enforcement officer on a Segway running a red light downtown. Well, new at 5 7 News reporter Mark Royal talking to the city of Denver. Mark, they tell you that behavior is unacceptable. That's right. It started at a downtown intersection like this. Now, those parking lot attendants on Segways, they're allowed to use these bike lanes that go up and down the road. They have to follow the rules, too. Clearly a red. He just blew right through it. This video sent to us from a viewer. It speaks for itself. This Denver parking attendant blazing right through a red light. We showed the video to a couple of people in Denver who've been giving parking tickets down here. You can imagine they aren't happy with what they see. He's driving right by a construction site too, so I'm sure there's you know like a little more danger involved or whatever. But you know he shouldn't be doing that, especially since he's enforcing the law. I almost got a ticket because I ran my bike through a stop sign. So it kind of sucks when you see city workers doing it and they just think they can get away with anything. The attendant ran this slide at 15th and Arapaho near CU Denver. So we took the video over to those at the city. They weren't amused either. Obviously that clearly does not meet our expectations for riding the segways. Um, our agents need to obey the traffic laws just like everyone else. Attendants are allowed to use the bike lanes and adhere to bike lights, but this is a no-no. So what's going to happen to this red light runner? We'll be talking with this employee and going over the training again with this employee because we do take this very seriously. Both Nicholas and Patrick agree if you break the rules of the road, back to the classroom you go. If they're doing something they're not supposed to do, then I guess they got to go back to class. This isn't the first time we've reported on something like this. Back in April, we caught a parking lot attendant doing this same thing. Coming up tonight at 6, what we saw today in shooting this story, eerily similar to that video. We'll see you then. Live in downtown Denver, Mark Boyle, 7 News. Got to follow the rules. All right, thanks a lot, Mark. We first learned about this story from a 7 News viewer. If you've got a story idea, use the Tell 7 News function on your 7 News app to send us a picture, video, or even shoot us an email.